Hello, welcome to the new video from City Inc Express. Today is our number three in a short series of videos showing you how to set up your sublimation printer package on a Mac PC. So today we're going to look at the paper settings and the print quality settings. So I have an image opened here on my desktop and I'm just simply going to go into File, Print, select the printer that I want to use and then if you if you need to rotate it scale fit or anything like that you can change those settings here and your paper size so I'm going to go into color matching so for the color matching this bit here means that Epson is currently controlling the colors which we don't want we need to we basically need the ICC profile so I'm going to select color sync and then in the drop down menu will be the one you need to select the one that you installed so for us we have the cream paper or the white paper these are ones that we'd already installed in previous steps so I'm going to select the one I need which is here this one and okay so what it's basically doing is it's telling telling it to use this profile when it prints I'm then going to go into the print settings and the only other thing we need to change is we just need to change the print quality so the print quality we're going to select for ours it's plain paper and fine quality high quality fine and high it's the same thing depending on which which version of Mac some say quality some say fine so papers vary some manufacturers papers vary and, and even some of our own models do vary if it's a, a setting that's different for some of our, our models it will say that in the instructions but as a rule it's mostly plain paper fine quality so we've selected a few things here now what I don't want to do is I don't want to have to keep selecting these every time I want to print so you can actually go into your presets here and you can save these settings basically as something that you want to call it so let's save current as a preset and let's call it A4 a4 cream sub and okay right so what it will do is if I select a different one you'll see the settings are changing around this area here now if I go back to select my cream a4 cream sub it then changes the settings back to what you saved it so you don't have to repeat yourself over and over again and then you can just print it from there you can use it, your Photoshop software or whatever the other software that you're going to use for it you don't have to you can use this uh, and that's it that's how you change the print quality settings on a Mac PC for our sublimation printer packages